hi everyone welcome back to tutorial night watch and also welcome to the channel step campus so we are going to talk about in this video about verify text presence in night watch okay so in previous lecture uh, we have click one button that is submit button okay this button we have click so in this video we are going to see like after clicking this button are we getting this surprise text or not so this is the uh, today's task okay so let's get started so i will use this code okay if you don't know about this code how i have written so you can go to my previous lecture and watch the playlist okay so you will get to know like how the syntax will be in night watch and how we are performing is uh, uh, click button okay so okay now uh, we have to uh, check whether uh, the surprise button is present or not so let's write okay so first we go there okay in the website so yeah so again uh, we have to open inspect inspect we can open either control shift plus i or right click and go to inspect option okay so see first we will see whether this element is present or not so let's copy a selector okay we go to the in, in this vs code and then we will write our code browser okay so what we are going to do first we are going to check whether the text is visible or not so browser dot assert okay dot dot visible what visible so we are going to pass the selector so this message is asserted means present or not okay just click okay uh let's see let's run uh, run this one okay so let's run this one yeah so what it will do it will open uh this website of click me okay it will click on me the button and then it will show us okay so surprise of the uh, text you can see here okay now go to our code sorry go to the command prompt let's see what you're saying saying the testing if element this message is visible so from this tick also we can see the assertion has passed now suppose this assertion has failed okay just write like negative browser dot asset okay browser dot not dot visible okay we know the surprise text will be visible but let make it false okay see what happening again we will go to this command prompt okay and then we will run the command so this time uh, message will be present but our assertion is negative so it will fail so we will test this one okay so it will open the browser it will click this click me button we have given some pause that's why it is waiting but not an issue yeah we can see surprise is there but we have a certain negative uh, scenario let's see what is happening it will definitely give an error this, let's see we have given some uh, pause that's why it is waiting yeah see what is it saying surprise message is not visible what we have added but expected it should be uh, expected is not visible but got okay our scenario is not visible but we got visible okay so negative scenario also we have tested okay this is that one this is the one method now we will talk about the second method okay so let's comment out this one first now here what we are checking now we are checking whether this text is visible or not but we are not checking this this is a surprise or not maybe the surprise spelling will be uh, something different for example it will be s u r p r i s w e for an example okay so this is a wrong right so let's see how to check that one okay so we have to write some other another line of code okay browser dot assert dot okay so this will be same now we have to check the content of the text so we have to write contain text contains text okay and then we have to give the x path okay so we will give the same x path okay and then we have to give the actual message so as uh, for now i am giving surprise sir price s is capital in the message also you can check there 
you can see s is capital okay so let's copy from here only why i am confusing you just let make it copy here and paste there okay okay let's see how it is behaving okay go to the command prompt and run it how i am running these things if you are not aware i am saying again and again go to my previous lecture watch all the previous videos then you are able to understand what i am doing here okay so no need to worry just follow the playlist okay so it's surprise like it clicked on click me and now we are getting text text surprise so now we will see in the command prompt it will automatically close yeah see it's saying key contains text is surprise so surprise we are getting here what we are doing here we are checking whether whether element is percent or not okay but in this we are checking what contains is present okay now let's make a negative scenario of this also okay copy this again paste this okay what we will feel okay we will feel like we will give smallest okay we will get smallest then definitely is wrong because the text should contains capital s but we are giving negative one let's make it comment out this above code now run it again okay so this time it will fail it will fail and it will say like expected and actual it will give us let's see what uh, night watch is behaving okay how it is behaving in actual scenario so test suit is running yeah just remember every test scenario is considered as a test suit in night watch okay so no need to worry it will click yes it clicked on click me button now we are going to see the negative assertion definitely it will fail uh, we have given some wait so we have to wait yeah see now it was failed okay why it was failed say expected content text this one we have given in a set this one should be expected but we are getting but does not contain this one is saying ki uh, expected is this one okay but this was not present this was not present that's why it was failed okay so yeah in this video uh, you have learned two things we get the four things positive scenario whether the element is present or not okay and if the element is present then we are checking what content what the text actually uh, present in this as a text okay now again the negative scenario whether the element is not present and whether the text contains are not matched okay these four things we have done in this module so we will see uh, in the next video about some importance and useful uh, we can say syntax so as of now in this video that's it so we will see you in the next lecture thank you so much bye bye